Hello, Joseph Clay here with my day one of the 2018 York Ebor Racing Festival. This podcast is sponsored by Bloodstock Evaluator. So, day one, we have tipping out two races today. All our tips are all based on Newcomb Standard Dosage, Voyer Dosage, which has um, a prepotent influence of six foundation sires of the thoroughbred. They measure turn of foot, stride, toughness, precocious speed, and stamina. We combine that with form to make an opinion. So, we have 225 Acom stakes. We have a Persian moon of Mark Johnson. So we feel like this horse uh, has a form, he has plenty of stride, turn of foot speed and some stamina over the new uh, maiden a novice winner, uh, Watan of, of Richard Hannon's horse, uh, who is very fast, by the way. And so we have him just edging him over, just catching him at the line to win the race over Watan for place. And then we have a dark horse that's very interesting of Kevin Ryan's, a uh, Swiss Tirius, who has... Um, loads of turn of foot in his dosage profile with stride and speed and a bit of stamina to, to be in the frame as well and be nice kind of rounding out your uh, dual forecast trifecta exacta butts. Always back your horses each way so if they do come in a different order. Going on to the 335 Judge Mont International Stakes. It's an amazing great race um, I think it's really going to be hard to beat Poet's word. He he has a form as well as his dosage profile is just amazing with plenty of turn of foot and stride and speed and stamina to be there in the frame. Uh, so we really f have him to win uh, over uh, Ben Battle. Uh, he's a horse of good dolphins that uh, seems to be improving. Um, he has a really nice profile as well. And we have him coming uh, in uh, place as, as well as we're going to go with a without parole. I think throw out the last race. Frankie DeToy is riding him. Um, <clears throat> should light the firm going uh, and should be in the frame as well. So Poet's Word, Ben Battle for second uh, without parole uh, to place in third. Good luck and have a great day. Thank you.